Energy Cabinet Secretary Davis Chirichir made his maiden trip to Kisumu's pipeline depot to inspect the newly constructed oil jetty that has since begun operation. Work done by KPC to facilitate uh, the transshipment of the transit goods or for that matter petroleum products to Uganda uh, for onwards movement to DRC, to Kigali, uh, Rwanda uh, and so on and so forth. Um, you of course are aware that uh, we are obligated to service the landlocked countries and it's our obligation to provide these state-of-the-art facilities. The CS said already five consignment of 4.5 million liters of fuel products have already landed at Entebbe, Uganda. We have done five shipments uh, using this facility. I'm told we are building another two or three ships, three, uh, more. three more like this. So that we could, currently we are doing once a week, we should almost be doing a daily to service. So there's still a lot of trucking uh, by road because uh, the facility as is today is not enough. So we are going to be bringing another two, three facilities to be able to service and be able to fill those tanks to service our neighbors. Mahati Infra Uganda Limited has put to use its offloading facility, storage tanks and a barge that will be used to move fuel between Kenya and Uganda through Lake Victoria. I appreciate that we need tankage and then so that um, the speed of loading, the offloading and unloading facility uh, on the other side of Mahathi mm. so that we are able to quickly push. You, the pipeline comes up to this, this place. Yes, correct. We've got a pipeline which feeds into the tank farms. Where are the tank farms here? Yeah? Yeah. And the tank farms, then we have got the pipelines which you have just seen feeding into the, the, the jetty. And we connect from the jetty to the ship. And then there is a similar facility on the other side with a tank farm of about 70,000 uh, metric, um, 70, metric liters. The CS say the transportation of fuel using the jetty will help in increasing the inter-trade between the two East African partner states. It's a great achievement uh, for our economies in terms of building the intra-trade in our region to make sure that there is seamless flow of uh, trade uh, within the region. Baraka Karama, K24, Kisumu.